What will your involvement be in the upcoming IAC, the International Astronautical Congress, starting next Monday in Naples? Well, there will be a, a day which is uh, reserved to, let's say, astronaut activities. It will be the last day open to the public, and uh, I will be there giving a presentation about what we have been uh, doing in space on the International Space Station, what I've, been, uh, what I've done uh, during my long-duration long mission, which was a year ago. What advice do you have for young people who wish to undertake a space career, not just astronauts, but space careers in general? Well, uh, yeah, there are a lot of things to do in space. I mean, not only being an astronaut. Uh, we need uh, engineers, we need physicists, we need, uh, we need a lot of people that do a lot of things because uh, going in space is a 360-degree kind of activity. I would uh, tell young people that they really need to find their passion, whatever it is, designing something, building something, going in space, or, or prepare food, or prepare clothing, or anything. But find their passion and then pursue it with, uh, with strong uh, courage, uh, desire, perseverance and, uh, and going, uh, going for it because uh, dreams are dreams but uh, if somebody works uh, hard enough, sometimes can make them true. Private enterprise, Chinese female astronauts, tourism in space. How do you see the space industry in 20 years' time? I would say finally, finally we are... Uh, opening up a little bit space, uh, no more to, but not only to uh, national space agencies, uh, but to public uh, or to um, commercial entities that are able to really develop uh, this and uh, touch uh, people. I'm really looking forward for the, the moment in which uh, people will be able to buy a ticket to space, to the International Space Station, go up and enjoy microgravity, enjoy looking at the earth uh, from up there and, and develop a, a really, I think, a different view of the earth as a, as a planet that is delicate in a, in a kind of equilibrium and we need to really maintain it uh, uh, and, and follow it in its uh, course uh, over the universe. I think this will happen. I think in 20 years this will be possible. Finally, what is your view on China joining the International Space Station program? Personally, I, I cannot speak for governments or for um, space agency. Personally, I think uh, I really welcome anybody joining uh, this venture. I think it's uh, humanity that needs to continue the course of discovery, discovering everything that's, that there is around us, discovering all, uh, all, uh, all the intricacy of uh, nature, and the more, the better. Commander Nespoli, thank you very much for talking to us. You're welcome.